ECU officials are investigating reports of drink tampering at a fraternity house. The three incidents are said to have happened in late September. Not in your side's Caroline Boyer shares how ECU students are reacting. Captain Chris Sutton says ECU police received reports from a third party of drink tampering at Theta Chi fraternity. Those incidents are said to have happened September 24th, 26th, and 30th. Nowadays, girls worry about that sort of thing, so we've always been like aware of it. University officials sent out an alert Wednesday evening. We just got an ECU alert about it, so it came through in an email to like all of the students. Students say they aren't shocked by the news. We're not really surprised about it. Definitely like disappointed, but also again, like she said, like not surprised that much by it. But they were surprised this might be happening on their campus. I know that's like a thing that happens, so I'm like aware of it, but I didn't know it was happening here. Female students say this incident will make them more aware when accepting a drink, and that's exactly the advice ECU Police Captain Chris Sutton has for students. Be very aware of what you are given or consuming. Um, from a beverage or um, from a food product standpoint. Especially with Halloween right around the corner. If you don't see somebody open it and pour it, well, then you shouldn't take it. Sutton says he can't remember a time this has happened at ECU. He's urging anyone with information to come forward. If it's something that has happened to one individual, it may happen to multiple people. And that's not just with this particular incident, but with any other incident where there was a potential crime that's occurred. Um, so timely reporting is very essential. The university students rights and responsibilities office is handling the investigation. Captain Sutton says it's too soon to know what kind of consequences the fraternity might face. In Greenville, Caroline Boyer 9 on your side.